Hello, this is uh, Itzu. Okay, I have changed the uh, input from the nano pulser, not coming directly from the uh, 24 volt battery stack, but uh, it now comes from uh, the yoke uh, slash mediator. Uh, we have the push pull which has the 24 volts input only and uh, we drive the yoke and the three turns is uh, driving the LC as usual but the former 28 turns I had for the uh, grenade I removed half of it so I have 14 turns now secondary and this goes into a uh, full wave bridge rectifier made of four fast uh, diodes and some filtering and this is about uh, 25 24 volts which I now feed directly into the uh, nano pulse so the whole system is now set up only from one 24 volt source being a battery so this should add some extra sinking or magic. Uh, I have only one bulb, 100 watt bulb in the rest is uh, not active, not inserted. I monitor the uh, output of the grenade, the DC, on my uh, multimeter. I took a shot of the nano pulse when it was active. Uh, we can see we have uh, still the 1.8 kV with this new setup and the, uh, the reflections coming back from the shorted coil. Uh, I removed the uh, parallel LC circuit so I have only the grenade as usual. I have uh, around the first part of the grenade I have wound the coax cable, the shorted coax cable first, shorted here and over this uh, coaxial cable I have the uh, inductor which is three layers bifiler instead of the two I had. This is uh, 19 meters long compared to the 38 meters of the uh, grenade so one to two. Um, like I said uh, Nano pulse is working ok I will add now some 24 volts to it. The nano pulse is not active we are pulling uh, 2 amps but you can see uh, we have about 36 37 volts I have the uh, connections reversed there but that's not uh, important. And we have a slight glow on the uh, first active 100 watt bulb because of this uh, 36 uh, volt. So the uh, induction from uh, the LC circuit to the grenade is severely hampered now because of the uh, nano pulser, the coax in between. Ok, let me activate uh, the uh, nano pulse and we can see that then the amperage goes up from 2 disconnected to almost 3 amps and we can see that uh, the output goes down when I activate the uh, Let me see what's on the scope. I should have done this before of course. This is uh, the output of the grenade. Sorry. And we can see we have something like uh, 76 volts. And uh, when it's being it's measured just before the full bridge rectifier from the grenade, 
and when we rectify it, it gets this 36 volts on the bulb, which is slightly glowing. Okay, I will activate again the nanopulse, so it's not on now. And you see some difference, but uh, not sure where where the pulse is at the moment. I guess I have to uh, search for it. Okay, let me activate it. I'm trying to see if I can find it. It's hard to do with one hand, of course, without making any shorts. And there we can see it now on top of the uh, pulse coming. So that's the influence of the nano pulse with the 1.8 kV on top of the grenade output. And as you can see, there's not much. Uh, to add by this nano pulsar. So putting this uh, 24 volts from the mediator does not show any additional magic in this first test. Okay, thank you for watching.